So pretty much all the best shot makers in the world all use low to high shot mechanics. And in this video, I'm going to give you six reasons why it's a better option. Number one, when you, when you have a low to high attack, you hit with a lot more overspin. Number two, when you have a low to high attack, you have better control over your trajectory. So if you want to go high, it's easy to go high. If you want to go low, it's easy to go low. Number three, low to high shot mechanics are very accurate. They're almost like shooting a basketball. Like, so you can have a high level of accuracy on all your shots. Number four, low to high shot mechanics gives you much better distance control. And if you've played this game long enough, you understand that distance control is really crucial. Like your deep shots, you got to go high and deep and it got to land within two feet of the back line or it's a free ball. Your short shots got to land within like three feet of the net. If they go a little bit too far, it's a free ball, right? So distance control is very important. Number five, when you have low to high shot mechanics, okay, low to high shot mechanics is like this, right? You can easily hit very sharp angles, very, very sharp angles, because from here, it's easier to hit the sides of the ball, right? If you're going back to front to hit your shots like this, once your hand is back, you can't hit the sides of the ball. So you can't hit really sharp angles. And number six, which is probably one of the reasons why so many players do it at the highest level, is that you can change your shot as you're leaving the ground, okay? You could jump and think high line, high line. Oh no, they're going there. Cut. Sharp cut. Okay. So if you don't have all of these things that I just mentioned in your shot game, then maybe it's time you start to consider changing to a low to high attack on your shots.